It's Alice today I'm going to be showing you guys how to remove a background away from a photo. Uh, the way I'm going to show you guys how to do this is with the program GIMP. Uh, this is a free program, you can find it just about anywhere. Um, so what you do is you click on it with your scaling tool, which I'll show you guys what the scaling tool is. It's right here, this little thing I have my mouse on, my cursor. Um, you're going to click right here or you can type in what size you want it, but I, I'm just going to drag it out. And you just drag it to the size you want it to be. Always make sure, though, that you have your keep aspect on. That way it doesn't get any distortion in your photo, which mine is probably going to be since it was already a small photo. It was really small. Okay, so I'm going to just show you guys how to get rid of backgrounds. Um, the way you do this is you can either use your eraser, which I used to use at first a lot of. You can just do this and it will make your background transparent. Or you can use this method that I found out about from someone, and you just do that, and then you, yeah, you select it with your little magic wand thing. I don't remember what it was called. It's uh, called a fuzzy select tool. Okay, so you can do that, and then you just press delete. If I can find the button, uh, delete, and there you go. Your background is gone, and you got a cute little meat boy. And to get rid of all the little edges, you can just use your eraser and just go over it again. But if it doesn't let you do it like that, you can just go over here to select none, which is select, select none, and then you can erase stuff. And you can always change the aspect ratio of your brush if you need to, make it like that, or like that. Or you can just have it round again, if you can never get it back to that. I don't, I'm not very good at finding it. Let's just click that and it goes back to round. Okay, and then you just make the brushes smaller to just get the little parts. See, like that. I'm, I'm, I, yeah. That's just erasing his side of his face, but uh, if you ever mess up, you can just use your undo tool and you just click undo and there it is again, it's, it's back. So yeah, that's basically the way you remove a background from a photo. And it's, it's pretty simple. It's a pretty simple process, which I'm feeling kind of lazy. And um, after you have all this stuff cold completed, after you get rid of all the little spots that you don't want there anymore, you can always go over to um, export as. And And then once you go back to your things, it's right here. And it's not gonna look like this, I promise. <laughs> you would just have to get rid of all the uh, red spots with the eraser and stuff. But um, it will basically have no background anymore. Background anymore, which is great. So um, yeah. So that's how you remove a background from a photo and stuff. So yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go and go. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love you guys. Goodbye!